spreading Christmas cheer, Charles and Camilla touched down in Borough Market to visit traders hit by June's terror attack. The Prince of Wales and Duchess of Cornwall shared some Christmas cheer with Borough Market traders whose staff and customers were caught up in the summer terrorist attack. Charles and Camilla, joined by the Archbishop of Canterbury, visited the popular London food market where knife-wielding attackers ran amok, stabbing passers-by after mowing down pedestrians on nearby London Bridge. Eight people were killed and scores of others injured in the atrocity in June. Borough Market was closed for 11 days but reopened with renewed vigor and is now in the middle of the busy festive season. When the royal couple first arrived they listened to a choir singing traditional carols and met representatives of charities associated with the market area of South London. Camilla, 70, looked festive in a vibrant red coat and leather gloves while Charles, 69, was dapper in a navy wool coat. The couple looked to be in excellent spirits as they perused the stalls, chatted to traders and even tried out some of the produce on offer. Earlier, the Duchess took on the role of waitress as she welcomed children into her home of Clarence House to decorate her Christmas tree. The wife of Prince Charles was more than happy to muck in as a hostess and could be seen offering out food to her young guests with terminal and life-limiting medical conditions. Amid festive scenes, Camilla invited the youngsters from Helen and Douglas House and Roald Dahl's marvelous children's charity to Clarence House, her official London home, for a fun-filled event, helping to decorate her Christmas tree before enjoying the slap-up tea. It is the twelfth year that the royal has held the party which is, she said, always one of the loveliest engagements of her year. Along with the children she met was adorable Anthony Brine, five who suffers from a painful genetic condition which causes his body to develop blisters both inside and out, from any kind of friction, called recessive dystrophic epidermolysis bullosa. After a meet and greet, Camilla invited the youngsters in to dress the Christmas tree with the help of assistant equerry, Welsh guardsman Jack Farmello, before serving up tea and goodie bags to the youngsters. In an off-the-cuff speech, the Duchess said, May I wish you a very happy Christmas. I always feel like today is the start of Christmas. It is such a joy to meet all of you. I hope the children have enjoyed themselves as much as I have. After helping the children to decorate the tree Camilla passed out Christmas gifts in Buckingham Palace gift bags. The event is held for families supported by Helen and Douglas House and Roald Dahl's marvelous children's charity. The Duchess is patron of Helen and Douglas House which helps families cope with the challenges of looking after a terminally ill baby, child or young adult who will die prematurely.